Good morning, this is Nshaman Oikel reading for Thursday, and this reading is for Capricorn. Welcome Capricorn. Before I start the Capricorn, I like to <clears throat> quickly explain the Moon and Stars Tarot, since I don't do Tarot readings, but this was a gift to me, so I think I will incorporate a card or so once in a while in my Shaman Oracle readings <coughs> to honor the friend's gift. Okay, and today I will use the Moon and Stars Tarot in your reading using one card. But before I do the actual reading, let me quickly explain the Moon and Stars Tarot deck because swords relate to shooting stars in this deck and swords they are the mind thinking divisions collisions and strife and cups relate to supernova and cups they are our emotions relationships bonds and clairvoyance and the ones relate to nebula and ones they are creativity, devotion, spirit, and action. And finally, pentacles relate to the full moon. And pentacles, they are finances, materialism, work, and home. So, and now, Capricorn, comes your reading. And the card that came out for you from the tarot deck is called Knight of Cups. And the Knight of Cups relates to romance. And keywords are investment, enthusiasm, and fulfillment. The Knight reveals a new opportunity for you the chance to meet someone new with big dreams and a positive outlook on life. They are determined and impulsive, so try to not get too tangled in their charm. They lead with their heart and they are romantic. As a new adventure begins, be visual and look at all of the finer details within this situation as it will be dreamy and if you are given a new job opportunity look into the small print as well as in a relationship be mindful of your partner's emotions be excited for what is to come as there is a soulmate energy around. The star message is look into situations a little deeper. The card, the shaman stream oracle card for you is benefactor, grace and generosity. The Benefactor also relates to gifts, support, and mentoring. When the benefactor weaves her energy into your life, you are put on notice that all manner of positive reinforcement is coming your way. The universe wants to let you know that just as you have been generous with others, Serving with your gifts, even in the smallest capacity, so will you be rewarded in myriad ways. The most beautiful gift the benefactor gives you is the recognition that you are stewarding and sharing abundance on behalf of a higher source one that is always working through you the motives for her the motives for her generosity to you as well as yours to others 
are intangible, although you will see the results reflected in the material world. The benefactor reminds you that it's in the purity of your desire to share without the need for reciprocity that, paradoxically, your initial generosity as is reciprocated tenfold, seemingly without any connection to the original act. Dream sharing and caring into being, and you will be amazed to see this vibrant seed take root and spread. Do it just because, and the benefactor will give you her blessing. The Oracle of the Fairies card, Capricorn, is believe in magic open your eyes and see the magic that's all around in nature the fairy of the northern lights says you are part of nature so you are magical too when the fairy of the northern lights appears she comes to tell you to open your eyes and see the magic that's all around you. The Aurora Borealis is pure magic and seeing the colorful ribbons of light dancing in the sky is on my many a wish list. Perhaps you too have felt drawn to see this phenomenon in real life if so, this card is confirmation that it's time to start making those plans. Or maybe another far away location is calling to you. When nature beckons you, your spirit knows the way to go. The message may not be so literal, however, instead this magical fairy could be flying in to remind you to open your eyes and heart to the magic and wonders of the natural world, so much of which we take for granted. The fairy of the northern lights says, when you are taking a walk, stop, look up, look down and see the magic that is all around you. Because sometimes we need a gentle reminder to, to stop and smell the roses and revel in the magic of nature. Perhaps you are being called to inspire someone else to see the world through new eyes of wonderment. Children see magic all around them and it is natural to them. So if you feel stuck in a rut, tune in to your inner child and learn to see the world through the eyes of a youngster once again. That was your reading Capricorn. Thanks for listening. I wish you a wonderful day today and on Saturday I will be back with some kind of a reading. Don't know yet what that will be. But maybe you drop in to find out. Okay, take care and goodbye.